tastesmb.ca is your online source for over 300 tried and true recipes, full episodes on demand, and exclusive behind-the-scenes content, including features on Manitoba's farm families. Subscribe today. We're introducing a brand new kind of toast to the party tonight. And of course, Manitoba Chicken is here, uh, Gina Sunderland, and we're on to open face chicken and brie sandwiches. Uh, and uh, of course, we've got our toast happening. Mm -hmm. So where do we begin? Of course, okay. we begin with the chicken. We begin with the chicken. So something I love to do, of course, is roast off lots of extra chicken so you can make great recipes like these chicken and brie toasts. Um, we've done three different recipes. With this one, we're going to use sliced chicken, our previous recipe was shredded chicken, and before that was cubed chicken that we made into a, like a classic chicken salad with a twist. So it's just so easy just to slice chicken breasts. You can have those. I like to chill them, and then they slice beautifully for shredding. Des, you know what? I just take that chicken and I just start to pull it apart. And and rip it off. Yeah, and it just shreds beautifully. So this is just, why you need to roast extra all the time or bake exactly. extra. Exactly. This, this is the moment. This is this what is it's the all about moment. right here. Yeah, perfect for these toasts. And then, of course, you can just cube for mashing into like a chicken salad. Okay, mm -hmm. so chicken, All right. now what? So I'm going to show you how easily these come together and, and something we were talking about is how, how great these are to bring to like a party, right? Because you can bring all the ingredients. It's not like you have to do it ahead of time. You can no. actually, and there's really not too many things. So, so simple. Put them together there. Yeah. Okay. Assemble on site, pop in the oven for a few minutes. So we're going to start out with half a cup of mayonnaise that I've infused with a clove of minced garlic. And I'm going to get you to just start putting that on our toasted There's garlic bread. in the mayo? There is. Mm-hmm. Yep. Just when you thought mayo couldn't get any better. <laughs> exactly. Okay. So Lisa. just... Perfect. I mean, I love a lot of mayo if I'm having a, a you know, chicken. I do too. Anything. I do too. But so just sort of like that. You are doing yeah. a perfect job. Okay. Perfect. Okay. And now I'm going to start layering this. It's all about building these toasts. So we've got our roast chicken. I like to put about, you know, three or four slices on top. I was going to ask you, I guess, like size of bread. I guess you could make these like sure. really, really teeny weeny or exactly. cut them into little pieces right, if you wanted to right. sort of make more like, I guess, like little finger sandwiches or whatever. Great right. idea. Sure. You could buy a baguette. You could toast that. And you'd have more like a little crostini style. And that is a super idea, Des. I love it. Perfect for if you're going to bring to a party. I mean, these are great for entertaining and these are great for absolutely any time as well. So this is great because like I could just sort of stop here mm. as I... <laughs> oh, me too. That's good. Me too. Chicken. All right. Garlic infused mayo. Yes. And beautiful, uh, you know, toast, toasted bread. Right. But no. No, we're we not going to start there. We've got more. So I'm going to get you to layer on that brie. Perfect. So yeah. Like just like so. I love it. Yeah. Okay. Just and like that, that is going to melt. And you know, these don't take long. So if you are bringing them to a friend or family for a, a great snack or for entertaining, they go under the broiler for literally like three minutes. That's and it. As soon as that brie melts, yeah. Okay. And guess what? I have some melting in the oven right now, so I better get those okay. out for us. All right. And then, Des, of course, we have to have <gasps> a final step. Oh, those smell good too. Wow. All right. So we're I, not done yet. No, we are not done yet. So I found a delicious local choke cherry jam. So the way we're going to finish these off is we're going to add that contrasting element of a little bit of sweet. So choke cherry jam works great. Any kind of a tart jam is, is beautiful for these. Neck so, and cherry, pin cherry. There exactly. You go. So Thank you. you. Okay. All right. So just come out of the oven and you just put a dollop of jam in the center. See, and I was just going to go spread it all over the whole thing. Well, you, you know, know what? Do, you can do it. Can I, I do whatever I you want? You can, <laughs> and I love that contrasting flavor. So yes, let's give it another extra dollop here. And isn't it just, like, it's it's just so, it's such an attractive. It is. It's beautiful. and of color it, on it, there. Yeah, it, it tastes amazing. Wonderful. So it's as good as it looks. And then we're just going to finish this off, dress them up with a little sprig of fresh thyme. Okay. Fire it on there. Oops. Perfect. Okay. There you go. Lovely. Lovely. All for right. sure. So again, um, all these neat little recipes, of course, on greattastemb.ca. And do you want to hit your website one more time? You got sure. You know, We've got a new website, manitobachicken.ca, where you can find these recipes as well as a lot, a 
also a lot of great cooking tips and chicken storage tips. So we're excited about that. <gasps> look what ah, we made, they Gina. look good. I can't look wait to did. eat these. Ditto. They're delicious. Ditto. So try these out uh, at your next uh, holiday party or wherever it is that you're going. Um, yeah. any, any place that you're celebrating and uh, let us know how they turned out. Uh, GreatTasteMB.ca. And of course, you can find us on social. When we come back, we have a, another hardworking family, a, uh, a chicken farming family. Uh, when we come back here on Great Taste of Manitoba. You're watching Great Tastes of Manitoba, filmed on location at Supper Central at Keniston Commons.